seen it on social media. Uh, it was leaked uh, about a couple hours ago. Uh, great news is uh, we're still hosting in College Park. And, uh, we are a three seed, uh, which we anticipated will play this Saturday at 11 a.m. right here in Xfinity against Radford. Obviously, the, the body of work that they've put together, I know uh, we feel fully prepared uh, going into this last run in the NCAA tournament. And I uh, can't say enough. I mean, you see our, our shirts this season with chemistry. Uh, you know, a lot of teams can speak it, but these guys live it. And there's a reason why they've won 28 games this year is because they've been selfless. You know, they're for each other. And, uh, you know, they just continue to you know, want to continue to do great things. So I know for us, uh, you know, the, this is the most exciting time and to be able to, to, you know, as they've done all season, work very hard to come back home to uh, have you guys, uh, the best fans in the country, uh, to be there on Saturday and Monday, hopefully, uh, if we take care of what we need to do, uh, being here in College Park. So again, go out and, uh, you know, obviously, uh, you know, invite some, some friends, you know, bring as many as you can out because I know, uh, you know, we're excited. We want to make a, a deep run, uh, you know, and, and now is our time to, to be able to shine. So, um, again, I, I thank you. I, I know there's uh, some extra dessert over here. If you haven't caught that uh, off to the right, our players will be here for a few more minutes to mingle, and uh, hopefully we'll see all of you guys on Saturday. Um, obviously, crazy day. Crazier than normal with the release and everything. Um, that's, that's a great with this team, what you guys been through this year, how do you feel that's prepared you for tournament time, which is crazy? It's literally surviving events, and you know, it's a different time of year. Yeah, it really is. I mean, uh, we're used to it, you know, when you have the body of work throughout your season and everything you experience. And so, uh, you know, we're built for it. Uh, we're ready for this moment. And, uh, you know, we're just excited to be able to tip off on Saturday. In the past, you guys haven't always taken care of business here to get it out of this, this region. What's, um, what's important for you guys to make sure you have the right focus to get out of college Yeah, you know, I mean, it's extremely difficult when you get into the NCAA tournament. A year ago, we weren't even hosting. So, um, one, you know, a, a goal for us was to be able to get back to College Park to be able to host. Now it's, um, you know, understanding, you know, how difficult every opponent is and um, being ready to, to go from the tip. We've heard in the past how much you talked about Kyla and leadership uh, before this season, throughout this season. How important is it that this team has her, Blair, Stephanie, for this room? Yeah, uh, well, we lean on our vets, and obviously our juniors and seniors, they've been through uh, the wars, they've been through these experiences, and that's what um, you want your upperclassmen to be able to teach uh, to, to your new kids. And uh, obviously, you know, our vets, you know, they've done a tremendous job the whole year, and uh, we expect it to be no different uh, coming into the tournament. Lastly, we talk about some of the new kids with the youngsters. They've had a big year. Um, do you anticipate any, any moments from them? Just, you know, with the lights being a little too bright or not really seeing what they've done during the conference. Yeah, no, I don't think the lights will be too bright and plus they're, they're playing at home. Um, but, you know, it, it is, you know, different, very similar to the Big Ten tournament. I, I think the first time you go through it to gain that experience. And, um, you know, that's all they need, obviously, is being able to go through it. But I know our vets will do a great job. Um, you know, leading them through it and, and uh, allowing them to understand uh, what it what it looks and feels like. 